to Men of Darker Gaming and we are here playing some Heroes of the Storm. Yeah, Heroes of the Storm again. I'm gonna get Death Patrol. I, I kinda like that um, increased. And we're playing as Nazabu. Um, we have Arthas Thrall, Murky, and Vala on our team. On the other team, there's Nazabu, Vala, Kerrigan, Arthas, and uh, Riga. Rehar. I think. I might have pronounced it wrong, but oh well. We're gonna probably go for the watchtower in the top side. We are playing on Sky Temple. And this is gonna be one fun game. And we have captured this. That is perfectly fine. And that puffer fish. I don't know where everyone's going, but this is interesting. They're probably planning on ganking top. Yep, they have all our up top. And we have Kerrigan right here. I am going to try stacking as much of the bonus stacks as I can from my voodoo trait. Or voodoo ritual trait. Uh, which allows me to get 5 health and 3 mana. Without hesitation. Permanently, so that kind of trait is very amazingly well. Definitely for this. Definitely one I can stack them all. Somehow I miraculously missed it. There we go. We must not delay. I'm gonna start hitting that bottom hand corner, um, bottom side tower, and I do want to, to run out of ammunition as soon as possible, and I'm already full health. It is really good. I am gonna fall back for the many reasons of, um, not wanting to die. Increased power about um bonus ability power. So each takedown is amazingly good. Now, hopefully I can get it stacked enough. We do have the top one. Or this mid. And I wanna seal them. Like that. Yes. There we go. Now, that take down just helped me out. Ah, oh, I don't want to die. No, I lost my ability stack, which isn't good. But we do have that bonus death patrol, which is amazing to always have. And hopefully we are fighting. There is a team battle right there. It's a 2v1. Looks like we're gonna push Nazabu back. And we have... We're, we're reclaiming the middle um, temple. We're recapturing it. We have one guy going in. And Thrall looks like he might... Nope. He was able to almost kill him. I am going to go with empowered their abilities. Which is a really strong ability, to say the least. And being able to get more stacks means more health for me in the long run. I can get a stack of 100 or more, I become really powerful. I do not want um, to go too far in. I am going to at least try taking this out. I think we might be able to take... Nope. I'm gonna fall back. At least take out these minion run right here. And we are past the first tier of tower in the middle lane. My teammate wants to capture the the bottom one, so I will go down there and help him out, which would be great. 
get those up. And we have one more. Looks like they're trying to capture it. I almost got myself stuck right there. Which would be horrible. But I finally somehow managed to get out. And I am gonna return back to base and heal up. I know I was outnumbered right there, and we should capture the bottom temple. Um, I want this temple. I don't think I will go by myself. I'm gonna wait by the first tower, set the towers right here, before moving in, because I'm pretty sure there's at least one or two of them in there already. Or not. We're surprised. Choose a talent. Well, I'm gonna surround this guy and get him the focus of the attention right there. Oh man, I'm not able to. There we go. That's a lot better. And I'm gonna do the summon. And there, I have captured it. I am gonna be staying right here. I'm gonna pull off to help them out, do some damage. And if I can keep this hold, it'd be really good. There we go. I don't need to hold on to it any longer. I can go up and push with them. And now we are doing good. We have at least 50 stacks. Almost 50 stacks right there. Amazingly well. And we want... They want to capture the boss, so... Let's do it. Help them out. It is a team game after all. We gotta do everything we can to get those stacks. And even helping them out, getting the boss will even will end up winning the game. Because the boss is pretty powerful. No one wants to get on top. Okay, we captured the boss. I say we push bottom. Now. Oh man. Not looking good for me. I'm getting slowed way too much right there. And I do lose my bonus for the kills I've gotten earlier. But, we will probably... I do want to go with the dead rush. Um, we could also go with sprint, which would give us 75% more movement speed. Um, we could do rewind, which would reset our cooldown, which would be also really good. I think... Um, Dead Rush would be even better. Having those extra minions to attack with would help out. The extra minions that can move does do... can can really change the game. Or a battle. Uh, I'm gonna head top along with them. Actually, we must not delay. Do you want to get this temple? My magic flows through the temples. Guardian, They're all aiming for it. Do not let these mortals. The top seems to be free, so. What do you know? Oh man. He's been pushed. Pushed back so far. There we go. Now I'm starting to get stacks of ability to power, which would help me out a lot. Ability power. If I can get that stack high enough, I should be able to survive any battle, as long as I don't get ganked. So I don't go out alone. I'll keep that over there. 
and I should be able to get claim this like nothing. I do want this. Increase the percentage of this voodoo. Because it does do poison and poison is amazing. Along with the um, duration increase. Oh my goodness, look at all this. This is a good time to get those stacks up right now. Look at all that. Boom. You got all that. That just gave me a lot of stacks. And now I can push up right here. I believe one of them is right here. Oh man, did we get ca- Yep, we got him cornered. And now I got three stacks of ability, which is amazing. And I'm still at full health. Now we can go for another kill right here. I think this would be perfect. Set it off. Boom. He's stuck. We can kill him. He's going down. No matter what, he was going to go down. Right here, we have Kerrigan. Will he? she go down? Most likely not. Yep. She will. We are doing good. We have a good standing. This team is actually doing good for being a pug group. And I have the siege damage lead. I do want to push up even more. I don't want to push up too much. Oh, I'm gonna pull back, pull back, pull back, no! No! That was horrible. I wasn't paying attention and we died. We lost all of our stacks. That is horrible right there to lose our stacks. But we need to make that up and hopefully gank the whole team again. Get all the kills. Um, right now we are leading in siege damage. We only have done 16,000 for that. Um, we might need to participate in more damaging the team. Um, Thrall has been doing a lot of damage, team damage, because he is a bruiser character. If you guys don't know what a bruiser character is, you should look it up in the LOL section of the definition. Bruiser characters are pretty well damaged. When it comes down to 1v1, you cannot take him out by yourself. That's why you have to gank him as a team. I do hate how... Um, trying to out, out kill him in a 1v1 is hard. Ah, uh, did I get? Yep, I did get both of those. Wow. That just gave me two ability power increase. So I think I gained what? The magic of the temples. I gained passively grants 8% ability power. Each hero takedown will gain me 2 ability power, up to 12. This bon bonus does not last upon death, or after death. That is fine. And look at that, I just took out Vala as it was nothing. Now I see. Which means we are actually really powerful at the moment. And I am gonna collect this um, siege camp right here. The siege camp will be a good use when we have the boss right there. It might be a little bit behind, but I am gonna return to base and our next crit is gonna be um, human go goalie? Goldie? Gaudy? Gaudy? Go Goldy? I don't know how you pronounce it, but we'll go with that. Of course. To have an infinite, um, uh, our ult, which would make it amazingly to have. I'm gonna use that ability so I can take them out faster. Stay on them, push forward with them. 
Look at that. We have more than 100. There we go. So now we have more than 100 um, stacks. We are getting, what, 540 health from it? Which is actually quite a bit in the long run. Okay, we got a kill right there. We're probably gonna get another kill right here. I hope. Yes, we did. We got five stacks right there. Now we... That, that is amazing. We could probably get another stack right here. Or another... Yeah, another stack. Just gotta hopefully kill him. Yep, we did. There we go. We got six stacks. Which is amazing. We we got six stacks. We got four kills. We're looking good right here. And all there is is Vala. Vala is the only one that is left. And my minion's doing work up here. And they should be on their last found. We push up farther, far enough to be able to do really nice work. We're we're at 127 percent or stacks. Vala is by herself, bottom. So it means we could technically help and gank her. Actually, they already got her. It's great. I don't want to push up. Yeah, I don't really want to push up. I never want to push up too far ahead. If I can lock this off right here. There we go. It's true. We must not delay. And we're doing good. We got six stacks. We have Kerrigan right here. I'm gonna not want him to fall into our trap. He goes down. There we go. We get another kill. We only get up to six stacks, I believe. So, there we go. Game over. 17 minute game and 25 seconds. That is not bad. Er, yeah. Not a bad game. I did enjoy that. That was a really good game and I hope you guys enjoyed and that's my daily for today and I'll catch you guys all next time.